suppose this is the best time to show it. Right when it's about twilight like this and the sun is setting. And the moon is very bright. Well, the moon's back there. You can see it behind the tree. Anyway, my, the transmitter's off. But I have my receiver coil that has the utmost sensitivity. And sometimes the light will light up just by itself as I walk. You can see it pulsing. It's picking up some kind of energy. And we're nowhere near mains, folks. This was built with Moray valve concepts. And this is receiving true free energy with zero input. There's no transmitter on. This receiver is receiving true free energy. It's probably receiving magnetic flux from the stars and turning it into electrical flux. Certain spots I walk over on the ground, it'll get very bright. It's really pulsing now. You can see that. It's pulsing. It seems to really pulse when I walk over plain dirt. I'm walking over my old garden that had tilled dirt. And this is just an antenna that dangles off it. There's nothing to it. Ooh. Pointing it in certain directions, it'll permanently be on. You see that? That's very interesting. This is true free energy. It's a detector. You see that? This is the exact spot I'm standing in. Standing around some kind of rock. And I hear my neighbors or something screaming, I don't know. Here we go. Ooh, it likes that. That is interesting. I'm standing over a big rock. Not sure what it's composed of. Yeah, the rock's definitely helping. bring this in my shed. You still see, you can really see it pulsing now. So this is my solar powered work shed. We have zero power on in here. And I should have thought this through while I was filming because I have no light. So I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna try and get this to permanently light. I'm gonna pause the video and connect to my external antenna that's out here. You can't even see it in the dark, but there's an antenna out here. Okay, I'm gonna pause the video and see what I can do.